OK, you're in Microsoft Excel and you want to use the if and the countif functions together in one formula. So in my scenario, I've got Bernard's sales and I want to work out which sales medal he has achieved. Now, to get the gold medal, he would need to have made at least four sales with this target value. So let's first of all use a countif to count how many sales amounts in this column C have met each of these targets. So equals count if. My range is the range of sales amounts, which I'll just select. And I'm going to lock that because I want to better copy the formula down. To lock it, I'm going to use F4 on my keyboard. That puts the dollars in those cell addresses. Comma. Now my criteria has got to be greater than or equal to this target. Now I'm going to type greater than or equal to directly into the formula. And that needs to go in quotation marks. Then I need to join that comparison operator with this cell address. And to join it, I'm going to use the ampersand symbol and then select cell F2. Now, if I close the bracket and press enter, that will count how many sales have met this target. Copy it down, it gives me the answer for the other targets. Now, to work out whether Bernard gets any of these medals, I need to run an if statement that compares this count with this threshold here. So, put the count if within the if function. Now, my logical test will evaluate whether this result is greater than or equal to this number of sales threshold here. Comma. Now, my value if true will be the medal description. Comma. And my value of false will be an empty text string, so an empty cell. So I then close the bracket and press enter. And then if I copy this down, you can see which medals Bernard has achieved. OK, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you next video.